It was a vivid, really vivid dream. It was, uh, I was at a, at a house party, but I was drugged, like sedate, like really drugged hard by something. And I was like stumbling and knocking into stuff and trying to talk like that. Full. And people were being really derogatory towards me and saying, who, who the fuck is this guy? Get this guy out of here. Who, who is this guy? And I was like, you don't understand. I'm drugged. And I could not ex I explain that I was, how I was drugged. I could not express, that, express it to them. And I felt completely like, no matter how hard I tried, I could not connect. And as I woke up, and it started to fade, there was a realization in, in my consciousness that I was experiencing autism. I believe that I was empathizing with someone that's autistic, that understands that they can't, that they can't connect. No, nothing they can do to explain it can get it through because it just is, is disconnected. I'm feeling it, so my words are feeling it. And I empathized greatly with it. With the pain of being misunderstood. And then other people said, well maybe that's just you expressing your own feelings of not being understood. And that's possible. In fact, I'm sure of it. My feelings and others' feelings are all connected. The feeling of not being understood, the anger, when people get angry, it affects me and I dream as I am one with autism, as I am the outcast. But I'm not really an outcast. None of us are. Or we all are, which means none of us are. We're all outcast. There is no the rest of them. Even though it seems like it, there's only individuals. And the last thing, excuse me, the last dream I just had a couple nights ago. And in this dream, I don't remember much, but as I woke, I remember the money, and I remember seeing clearly the correlation when you bring money into it, then the correlation between the subscribers, the numbers, it, and the money, it becomes money, it becomes dehumanized. It becomes about getting more. So, I'm not going to put a PayPal button on my website. I'm going to continue to work to make my money. What is work? This doesn't feel like work. I have enough money. The money will come. I wish it didn't have to come through being on commercials, holding products in my hand and smiling. Why can't it come through this? Why can't I just talk to you? Why can't I just talk to people? Just talk. Why can't I just explore and not have to worry about finances? It's a very egocentric desire, but people do it. I got my bachelor's. I'm not a fool. Some some uneducated... Not that be, being uneducated makes you foolish, but being educated helps you to put together what you understand as a human being and what we understand as... storage units.
you know what, I don't know. Education itself is kind of not useless. It's certainly not useless, but it's not... I'm sorry, but whether or not you went to college really is not that big of a difference. Honestly, whether or not you graduated high school is not that big of a difference. The, the people are... We learn what we want to learn. You know, once you understand how to com communicate with people, you don't have to learn anything because anything that you need to learn, you can figure out at any time just by asking. No one has to learn all the answers so that they don't have to ask. We're not, we don't hoard knowledge, we just offer what we do know. Well, this was a long video. Uh, I'm looking forward to watching it. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm sure you enjoyed it. In some way. Hope it didn't make you angry. Who is you? Who am I talking to? I'm talking to myself. Like, it's all these second guessings. There's no second guessings. This is an amazing experience for me. And for everyone associated with it, whether or not it makes you angry, you like it, you hate it, you subscribe, you unsubscribe, you watch one and then you can't watch any more, you watch them all, it's all the same. I believe that it's affecting you, because it's affecting me when I watch it, and if it's affecting me when I watch it, I would assume that it would affect other people when they watch it, if they watch it. But those are all assumptions. And all that matters is that it's affecting me. So I'm not going to assume for you. I'm letting go of you. I'm letting go of the numbers. I find, I find that we'll be better able to associate when we let go. And with that being said, I'll talk to you later. I feel unsatisfied. Perhaps that's the cycle of life. 